What is up guys, my name is Comedy, and today I have a brand new video, it is a Unturned 2 update. Yeah, you don't hear this very often, we actually have an update for Unturned 2, and this time I can actually do it inside of this beautiful, beautiful beta. So let's go over everything, it's actually update 4.20.2.0. Oh, and it added a lot of stuff. I'll have all the update notes in the description, a little link. You can click on that, walk, read it for yourself, but I'm going to go over everything just to show you guys what there is added, and there is quite a lot. As you can see right now, I actually have a health bar, so when I get shot, that red bar will start getting less and less. I'll show that off later on. But first, I want to go through all of these little lockers, which basically show off what the update has to offer. Firstly, we have canned beans. There is nothing wrong with that. We have some beautiful canned beans, as you can see, and we can uh, somehow eat them. I'm not sure exactly how. Maybe we can eat them once we take some damage. We'll have to see. So we'll just keep that in my inventory for now. If we go on to the next one, we have a beautiful modular backpack and we have these which i'll go talk about in a bit and lastly we have let's see what this is a plate carrier which shows off more of what we're going to be talking about very very soon this is basically the update that has been given to us so we have a modular backpack plate carrier some plates you see armor plates and canned beans now if we look at everything you will notice that it has a weight everything has a weight let's go to the gun too everything every single thing has the weight the modular backpack has 32 kilograms the plate carrier has one kilogram eagle fire will have four kilograms and this weight adds up i'm not sure if you can see the total yeah no i don't think you can see the total weight you're carrying maybe that'll get added later but i'm pretty sure what from what i've read is it's supposed to affect your speed so let's see this is how fast i'm running right now with everything okay now let's strip how do i drop everything okay Let's just drop, 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 just carry some canned beans. Now I'm running like this. As you can see, I don't know, it might be hard to notice, but I'm a lot faster compared to before. So, yeah, essentially, now that all this is getting added, we're going to have weight and it's going to make us slower. When we're carrying, let's say, a bunch of military clothing, it's maybe not going to be as beneficial. It might be better beneficial to wear different types of clothing for raiding, maybe like that thief clothing in Unturned 3.0. That way, you can run a little faster, get through things faster. Anyways, that's what we have right now, and I like it quite a lot. So that is everything we have. Wait, now, next thing I want to talk about is actually the modular backpack. As you can see, there's a top strap and a bottom strap. Once I take it off, this is how the backpack looks on the back. It looks... I guess kind of empty just pretty flat you can actually find these things they're called vest pouches and they can actually go onto the backpack one for the top strap one for the bottom strap and if you don't notice look at right here at the very bottom when i take it off it goes away when i put it back on it adds space it adds space to your backpack so i'm assuming this backpack can only carry two different vest pouches a top strap and a bottom strap but there might be backpacks that can carry even more who knows so without this of course you still do have some inventory space this just adds a whole lot more that's just beautiful boys and lastly we have a plate carrier now you might be thinking what is this plate carrier for well it's for none other than the armor plates and these armor plates is exactly what it sounds they are armor plates armor now actually blocks damage only when it's a uh, high durability armor let me explain that this one has a little green i guess flag you could say that means it is lightly damaged so that's going to be pretty strong compared to this which is heavily damaged this one only has 460 hp but this one has 8,000. so this is going to be able to block a lot more damage than this one that is just beautiful so yes we do have armor plates and what armor plates essentially do like i said they block damage i don't know if it blocks damage completely we'll probably try to test that out in a bit but at least it blocks some damage is what we know and, and and when you do have armor when you get shot what the update notes say is each plate has a health bar which absorbs bullet damage and when armor gets impacted it shows sparks rather than blood to indicate a hit once again we'll look that over very very soon but let's see how this looks as you can see, we just put it on. Looks like we just put it on anywhere. Oh, this can only go on the back. This can't go on the left side, right side. Left side, right side can only take generic plates. So these are generic plates and these are body plates. So body plates. And then we have the left side, right side. We'll use this one's going to be actually be the strongest. Put that right there. Can we add more? 
No, we can't add any more. I suppose we have. Oh my goodness. Now it is winter. Oh yeah, and I just noticed the plate carrier actually has little pouches as well. And that's the only way it holds inventory. Without the plate pouches, the plate carrier is just exactly what it sounds. It's just armor. But now if we add it, we actually can add some inventory to it. Anyways, let's take off this backpack. And this is the plate carrier. And actually, the plates are invisible. You can't actually see the plates that are on it. But if we look in it, we can see that we do have plates on the plate carrier. As well as, I'll carry the backpack. Okay, now let's get shot with these plates. You might be thinking, how do you get shot? Because, of course, I have no friends. Ooh, they're showing off the snow again. That's always just beautiful. And how it slowly fades back in that's actually really cool you'll be able to see where someone is if they're running away from you you'll be able to follow them pretty long actually that stays for a while anyways if we head over to the top of this mountain you're gonna notice some people up here they're not my friends but they are enemies they're actually npcs that we can fight so if you shoot this guy in the head two three four four headshots and he's finally dead let's have this guy shoot me let's see what happens when he shoots me Okay, well, I guess he just got some headshots on me, so that was unfortunate. I was trying to see the plates work, but that's okay. Anyways, these are NPCs. Yes, NPCs are actually in the game now. As you can see, he has a beautiful gun, and he has a little bit more attachments than I had. He's fully clothed out. He walked right over my box for some reason. Of course, that is what happens when you finally kill someone. You get a little box that, of course, you can loot. But yes, these are NPCs. Sadly, I couldn't really get the armor to actually function. But I'm guessing he just got headshots. Maybe the NPC has too good of aim. But regardless, if you get shot in, let's just say the chest, the torso, the back, the side, the armor should protect you. I'm pretty sure this guy has some armor on. Yeah, this guy does have armor. I don't know if he has any armor plates on that, but he does have armor. Now, what we're going to do next is get shot a little bit. Hello, hello. Come on. What you got? I think he's out of ammo are you out of ammo sir sir are you out of ammo okay now they should have some ammo i'm gonna have them shoot me because i want to try out the canned beans um oh okay 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 here chill 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 okay i, th I think these guys have <laughs> they have too good of aim okay <laughs> they have too good of aim i just don't want to completely die the chill you can't even see me oh my goodness gracious these npcs are beasts okay but as you can see i just killed someone and my health is now down let's eat some canned beans consume and it brings my health all the way back to full so right now canned beans act as basically the health item in this game right now it already does kind of heal you in um unturned 3.0 if you eat some canned beans of course it does a lot of food but it also restores a lot of your health right now it looks like it's an instant heal but there's nothing wrong with that that kind of just shows off how maybe the health kind of works but that is basically everything that there is in this update if you want to see the rest of the update notes like i said they're in the description and there is one more thing i couldn't actually find it though and it is the gilly camouflage there's actually gilly camouflage in this game now so i'm actually going to show a video real fast of nelson showing it off in this devlog and as you can see he's wearing a gilly suit and he has some gilly on his eagle fire it looks pretty nice and I'm actually very hyped to see how this ghillie functions. It's supposed to function a lot better than Unturned 3.0 because he talked about how in Unturned 3.0, you can just disable the foliage and then ghillie suits are basically useless, but that's not going to be the case in Unturned 2 and I just can't wait, boys. But that is all for the update. Update 4, point 20, point 2, point 0. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. More Unturned 2 content to come. My name is Comedy and I am out of here. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.